kitchen again with Chef Ricardo cooking show guys this one going to be amazing recipe this one going to be a Saturday morning healthy porridge recipe for me anyway we have a lot of recipe on the YouTube channel talking about porridge making porridge you know Chef Ricardo always I do this recipe so big up all of the so big up all of the fans I'm all support Chef Ricardo with it porridge and over crescent porridge a lot from me first of all i got two fingers of banana and one half a finger of plant we're going to make some porridge again on the youtube channel so first thing i must say you know chef was always put on his gloves so first of all, you have to be careful of the steam and you don't want to steam up the hand guys. So what do you do? Cut off this two part of the planting. Draw a line across the planting. And then cut it up very small. Two fingers of planting of banana. I'm just gonna remove the skin. Cut them up like this. Just gonna remove the skin of this one. Draw a line across the side. Remove the skin from the foot from the banana. It's good to use gloves because you're not gonna mess up your fingers. See? Nice and easy. Cut it up. Nice one. After you do all of those hard work. Gonna put our nice, lovely one tablespoon, two tablespoon of cornmeal, fine cornmeal. Then we're going to put some coconut milk. We're going to use roughly about quarter cans of half cans of coconut milk. Let's use up the rest of the coconut milk. And some milk, whole of milk to free up the blender. Now what you do? Cover it like this. And blend it for about four to five minutes on a good ninja blender. Nice and lovely. So basically, just finish blend it and nice. The way I blend it just, just come out really lovely and creamy. Look at that. And it smells really nice. I can't wait to drink this. So enjoy the recipe. And now we're gonna show you how to cook it. Yes, as you can see, a lot of steam taking place right here. So what we want to do is this. Take time and remove the lid. Yeah, nice one. And as you can see that the water is boiling up. That's what the main thing you want to do. You want the water to boil up like this. And I have two and a half cups of water. Now I'm going to pour my liquid inside of it like this. Take time and whisk it. Scrape out everything inside of it, the container. We don't want to leave nothing inside of it. So it's just banana and plant and caramel porridge. Really nice one. And I know the fans of me love this one. So this one, you can make it for Saturday morning breakfast. Or some people drink it on a Friday morning for breakfast before they go to work. Look at that, nice. 
so you just keep stirring it like this and you will get really thick up so what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna keep the camera right there and make a guy see exactly what is taking place see you're gonna just get really thick and I have my temperature high as you can see really red so basically it, we're gonna make it cook very quickly As you can see you're gonna see start to get really thick up so basically what you want to do now yeah is turn on your stove low at a low temperature because when it start to pop up you don't want to get burned so cover it and see exactly what's gonna take place all right As you can see start to pop that mean it's getting there and I turn on my stove to two now and a low temperature so let's give it a stir again because I don't want it to get lumped up lump up so you can see it start to get thick it's nice Yeah, you see? Really nice. So cover it and let's look at it again to see exactly what's going on inside. So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna put it at three. A little bit more heat. Not too much. Cause you don't wanna get it too overcooked and start to pop pop top. So basically you just wanna just keep it at that. Alright. So let's let's see exactly what's taking place right there so let's give it a stir again that's look good see when it get thick so let's turn it down to one so if it's too thick you can always add a little bit more milk So it's a little bit too thick and choose a little bit too thick what you can do is this and a little bit of milk to it give it a stir so that's perfect so i always say to my fans and keep less water in the pot and more of the ingredients you can always add to it so that's perfect so what we're going to do now let that to cook for roughly about 10 to 20 12 to 15 minutes on a medium size eat i have it one at the moment allow it for it to cook nice and lovely guys so basically the porridge has cooked now we need to sweeten it so basically look at that that is fantastic guys and amazing anyway we're going to put some vanilla before we put the vanilla let's put a pinch of mix mix spice nice one and also a pinch of jamaican nutmeg So some salt just a pinch of salt not too much I'm using sea salt which is good nice one teaspoon of vanilla another teaspoon then what you need to do sweeten and taste as it goes along by adding some sweet condensed milk Nice one. So I'm going to sweeten it now. As you can see, this is looking fantastic. A 
and it's looking good so basically it really looks so good we're going to taste it honestly honestly not because i am the one who making it but this tastes perfect So what we're going to do, leave it for about four more minutes and the next time we will be sharing out it. All right, enjoy it. Really nice. Nice and lovely guys. So basically as you can see, exactly what's taking place right there. Same thing, nothing doesn't change. We will pour out our porridge like this as usual. As you can see, look at that. That is an amazing recipe, guys. And as you can see, exactly what's the place right here. Look at that, really nice. So hopefully you will just love the recipe. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel and thank you so much. Banana and plant with cornmeal, sweetened with condensed milk, coconut milk, and all these things. So enjoy it and subscribe, leave your comments. And my name is Chef Ricardo. We got a lot more recipe will be coming for you. See you next time. Bye bye.